I would like to go on record and say that the doctor's uh, hand was so good. From day third onwards, I stopped my antibiotics and I never took a painkiller. Hi, this is Asta. Uh, I'm from Canada. Uh, I visited Divine for breast reduction surgery post delivery. Uh, it's been a month now um, and I'm visiting them again uh, to have my checkup. It's a wonderful pleasure uh, to be uh, with Divine for my surgery. So I basically contacted them from Canada itself and uh, initially they contacted me and it, it was very nice the way they contacted me. They were supportive. They took my pictures online without having a money into their bag. Uh, they did an online consultation. They did a video consultation. They even did a 3D uh, consultation uh, for the surgery. And all the staff was uh, very uh, cooperative and they were very mindful about the time zone difference. Um, so yes, it, it's, it's just, just been pleasure. I, I cannot complain about anything so far. Actually, I would like to go on record and say that the doctor's uh, hand was so good that actually my body reacts a lot towards antibiotics. So from day third onwards, I stopped my antibiotics and I never took a painkiller so far. And it's still healing well and no pain. Uh, I have twins and I took a lot of uh, medicines for uh, producing milk so uh, there was an enlargement uh, and due to which i had a backache so i need to go through uh, through breast reduction here um yes a lot um i'm feeling very confident uh, there's no pain uh, i I'm, I'm just feeling very good about about my, my own body So in Canada, it's not easy to go through aesthetics um, surgeries. So I needed, and anyway, we were planning to visit India. So I wanted to get it done in India itself. I had contacted a lot of uh, clinics, um, but I found Divine to be far more committed towards their patient. The way they handled me on the phone, Initially, somebody guided me wrong, so I asked Dr. Amit about the same suggestion and he clearly said no. Somebody said, uh, asked me just to remove the breast uh, because it can cause problem, but then he said no. So he guided me in the right way uh, and everything, as I told previously, everything happened without them asking even a penny out of me. So, um, and then I took, saw their reviews, I, I saw their patient's history and I really liked it. So that's why I chose Divine out of four or five after reviewing four or five uh, clinics who deal with this kind of surgery. So overall experience was very good. I got um, like my surgery got scheduled um, as per my timing. They were very, uh, very cognizant about when I can make it. And then I was here for a day. Uh, the staff is really nice. They held me throughout the night. Um, they they were there for me uh, just a, just a bell away so it was really nice the staff is really good the doctors are really good everybody is like superb I am I'm expecting it to be really good uh, because I'm already very healed I would say 80 85 percent I'm healed um, I, I'm, I'm feeling very confident about my own body there's no pain um, so yes I, I'm, I'm looking forward like once this is all done, because doctor is still saying that one and a half month more to go in order to be like back to proper lifestyle. But yes, so far it's good and I'm, I'm looking forward for it. And last thing is that my scars are fading already. It's just been uh, hardly one month. Um, the scars are fading and the um, uh, doctor said that it will fade in a couple of months and I I'm seeing that difference uh, actually. So I think like the way my body is reacting to a surgery, I, I personally don't think it will take two months, even two months. But doctor said the upper limit would be two months. The scar will be gone by then. So yeah.